Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week, and we're just moments away from kickoff time. Stay tuned for the live action. Hello from the Catalan capital and one of the world's great cities, Barcelona. I'm Derek Ray. I'm joined for commentary by former Arsenal fullback Lee Dixon. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Barcelona against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, I hope you are as excited as me the start of the Champions League. Always a special atmosphere. Both teams will be hoping for a long journey. Or it may be very, very short. We're about to find out. I think, Lee, we all look forward, don't we, to the various stages of the Champions League, from the group stage to the knockout stages. Each has its own dynamic. Well, it does. I certainly get a little bit more excited when the knockout stages start, I must admit. But the, uh, the group stage is an introduction to everybody, to all the teams that are in the competition. I think that's vital. You get to know the players, the teams, how they play. And then once the knockout stages start, the real excitement for me kicks in. Busquets. Coutinho. This is what we think for Barcelona. Marc Andre Ter Stegen stands between the posts. PK starts alongside Clément Langlais in the centre of defence. And up front, Lionel Messi is the main striker. It looked as though he was in, but credit to the defender, Lee. Yeah, he hassled him, made his hurry shot there. I must say, it's always great fun to chronicle a match through the prism of Lionel Messi, watching what he does in a game league. Well, how much stuff does he do on a pitch? He's just endless. 90 minutes isn't time enough to fit all his brilliance in. Normally goes toe-to-toe -to -toe with Ronaldo every single season. This season's no different. Bakker has it. And now Gay. A real opening now. And mistimed the run, sadly. That's offside. Neymar. Icardi. Idrissa Gay. Lorenzi. Mbappe. Good defending. Jordi Alba. Messi. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw in. the pass not finding its target Icardi Neymar strongly in PK Griezmann tremendous block was perfectly timed and it is going to be a corner it's a short one and they'll get ready for the throw in Messi and one by Verratti Backer has it. Verratti. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Well, it could be on for him here. Verratti! And there it is! The opening goal! 
1-0 and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, this is worth another look, Derek. Lovely movement and guile to easily evade the defender. And then the brute force and guile in equal amounts sets up the chance to score. And he doesn't disappoint, does he? Well, back underway here. What sort of response will that goal elicit from Barca? Coutinho. PSG possession starts are pretty bad, but again, we've seen it before, we'll see it again. Their counter-attack play has been absolutely fantastic. Pace really hurts defences, and they've got that in abundance. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Dangerous ball, and clears his lines. Excellent challenge. Fati. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Well, the first 45 minutes have come. In. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Icardi. Mbappe. Here's Icardi, Verratti, masterful piece of foiling. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, Marco Verratti, no surprise, stamped his authority on the first half. Lee, your thoughts? Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. Lorenzi. Ansu Fati might be able to get in behind the defence Antoine Griezmann waiting a decisive clearance it was Di Maria here's Icardi Neymar Mbappe and now Gay. And winning it back. He's going forward well here. Verratti. And he takes on the shot. And held with ease by Ter Stegen. Idrissa Gay. Di Maria. An awful lot of green space to run into. Lorenzi. Gay. Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Cuts it back. Will it be Marco Verratti? A oh, tremendous block. Well, in the second half, trailing, albeit by a small margin. How should they be viewing this task, Lee? 
Well, how many times have we seen Barcelona get late, late goals? They will not give up, that's for sure. They'll pile the pressure on. Surely they will get one more chance. And the referee says corner kick. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. But it can't get all the way through. De Jong just can't get it past them. And the assistant referee has raised his flag offside. And it's a case of just five minutes left. How can they find a late leveller? Dembele. Dembele. It wasn't far away from the target, Lee. No, it was decent. Really, really decent chance for the lad. They'll keep pushing away to try and get that equaliser. There will be one minute added on at the end. Mbappe. Let's just name R. And that is that. Barcelona, I must say, will be scratching their heads based on this. An awful start to the Champions League season. That's the last thing you need. Start of the qualifying stage.